Hey guys, I know I haven't posted in a while, but I thought I'd show you kind of what I've been up to. I know last time I did a little video, I think one of the last videos, I was showing some of the trading stuff I was doing and uh, working with like writing trading view scripts to do my own bots. Um, since then, I've worked on a few bots. One of them was I did some Forex trading, I made like six bots uh, trading Forex. Those are doing okay. I think those are making about one and three quarter to 2% per month, but I thought I could do a little better. So I started messing with uh, some crypto stuff. And in the meantime, uh, I found a group called David Tech that's, uh, uh, they got a Discord channel and they do a bunch of, they have a bunch of trading strategies. So where I was writing my own, I found these guys have like hundreds of strategies and uh, which is pretty cool. You can see them all here. Uh, there, uh, the problem is there's so many, it's hard to find like which ones are profitable, but what's super cool is we have all this data. So I thought I would try, uh, some of their strategies. And what I did is I made a calculator so I could try to find the best performing strategy, uh, made this little ranking calculator here. So what I can do is put in the, uh, the link to their Google sheet into here and then put in uh, the coin pair. In this case, I wanna find all the unique ones. Um, or we can, we can just do all. So this will get like all the coins there are. Uh, and then I created an advanced section so some people can create their own uh, weighted uh, algorithm basically to determine which is the best strategy. So if I run this, you'll see it'll populate the file below basically organizing all these strategies by uh, ranking, like which one's the best. So made a little ranking algorithm. If you go to the very end here, you'll see like the ranking score here, which is a math formula based on not these numbers, but the numbers I put in here when I selected my, my JSON profile here, which has different than default. Um, so yeah, so these are all the strategies uh, in order. And what we can do is kind of go through here, then I can actually deploy these to trading view and actually start uh, doing trading. Uh, I also have it sortable by broker. So if you have your specific broker, you can uh, sort it by broker in the field above. But like, let's just say this is, let's go ahead and open this one. You'll see this strategy here, according to my algorithm is the best one, but I mean, it it's kind of subjective. You can say what's the best for the short term, what's the best for the long term. Uh, you can kind of adjust that algorithm because I have like by seven days, 30 days, 90 days, like what's going to generate the most revenue over specific criteria. So you have some wiggle room there. I want to kind of gravitate towards like long term where I don't have to think about it all day, every day. So this is uh, that strategy I just showed. And you can see this equity curve. So you put in money and you can just see your money grow pretty fast. Uh, this one made 952% profit, 77% of the trades win, uh, 4,900 trades have won, 2.6% profit factor. And basically what this represents is every dollar you put in, you make $2.6. So, and the max drawdown is big. That's, that would be the only negative on this. I try to like not have one over 20%, but that's all the performance on this is pretty good. Now you can look here, uh, the month over month performance. So since 2022, this is the monthly performance of the strategy, which is pretty good. It's beating all the markets, right? Uh, I don't see any negative months here. We have some pretty low months. Some of the other strategies are gonna have really negative months, but uh, it's pretty good return uh, for your money. And then uh, we'll jump over to another one. Just grab the second one. I don't know what each of these are going to show either. I haven't pre-ran through this, so we're just kind of winging it here. But they're all pretty good, right? It, it sorts through them pretty good. There's some that I don't believe in, even though it shows them. But uh, check this, like this one here, 54% win rate. And then this is kind of can be deceiving only because like the, the win rate may be like two to one, right? So you may earn $2 uh, for every one, every time you win versus a, a loss, you may only lose a dollar. Uh, because you put trailing stop losses in place. So even though some of these will show a lower win rate, uh, you're going to have, when you do win, you're winning double what you lose when you do lose. So uh, 
profit factor. So this is a nice drawdown, 11%. So the most you would ever go negative is 11%, or the most this, is, this has ever gone down. And that doesn't mean it sold negative 11%. It just meant it was down 11%, possibly between trades, right? Um, it could have had a sell at 11% down, but most of the time this just represents what is the lowest that your equity went during your trading. Um, 2100% profit or net profit. So you can just see your profit gain. I mean, over time here, you can see here towards the equity curves kind of flattened out recently. So that's where you get kind of like, do you want to be winning based on the current trends or overall? Um, you can see your monthly performance here. So pretty good. You had one negative month of 0.3%, right? So overall in these last two months have been slightly negative. But overall, you probably expect that to return because you've only, this is the first time it's ever had two consecutive negative months. Um, and you can see here the last seven days we're down 1%, but you can expect probably 5% over the next month since it was almost 10% for the previous 90 days. Um, yeah, and then these are your most recent trades. Pretty cool little setup. Uh, and then what I do is I just go ahead and grab these strategies. I made a export here that exports setup files that I can then export and then I, it sets the strategy files up for me to be able to use them in TeamViewer here. So I can go ahead and easily come into TeamViewer. I can set up my trading alert. I come in here, like here's a sample of an alert. So you set up your, your alerts here and then your API where you post to. Uh, right now, I post to this third-party API, but we're currently building our own API because sometimes these trades are failing and not actually making it to my broker. So I want a little more control over that. We we did a beta one that's working right now, but I'm going to uh, uh, completely uh, have like more of a public one working. But anyway, it's pretty dang cool. Uh, hopefully, this works because it looks like some of the returns on these strategies are really good per month. And I'm hoping uh, I'll set up an account with multiple different uh, coin so that you've kind of diversified. If you look at like, let's say, uh, let's find one that's got a little bit more negative, a few more negative months. I, let's see, let's see if we can find one that's got some negative. I'll kind of give you my theory of like diversity. So like you have a down month, you have one that's losing one month and then one that's winning. Okay. Yeah. So say this one had a big drawdown, you're, you're negative 25%. So you actually lost 25% of your account in May. And then what you hope is you have these other strategies running the same time and to balance it out, right? So May, this one was up seven. And then say you're running this one too. In May, it's up five. So overall, you say you have 20 strategies running. It, of the 20 strategies, it's gonna average out that loss so that you actually uh, would be still be up throughout that month. Because it's not very likely or not very often you'll have multiple strategies losing uh, in the same month. So like this one may is up, right? So you would have it diversified. So on some tokens and some strategies may be poor, performing poorly in one month, you've got other strategies and other tokens that are performing better that month. So that's kind of the idea here. Uh, I just launched 20 different tokens uh, yesterday on an account. So we'll see how my little strategy ranking tool works in the real world. So uh, I'll keep you guys posted, but this is kind of a I mean, for me, it's a lot of fun right now, and uh, it's one good way to put my, my money to work right now because I don't really trust the direction real estate's going, and I don't really trust the direction that the economy is going in general. Like, I don't really see a good place to put my money, so why not uh, play with some of this stuff here? So, anyway, I just thought I'd give you guys an update. Hopefully, you guys think it's cool as I do. <laughs> Probably not, but I'm enjoying it. All right.